Hi, it's Carrie. Today I'm looking at some of my favourite Schleich dinosaurs. I really like this T-Rex and the Stegosaurus. Can you tell me how tall the plates grew on the back of Stegosaurus? Subscribe and give a thumbs up if you like dinosaurs. There are some older battles at the end of this video you might like to have a look at them too you can see an improvement in my editing skills stegosaurus lived in the late jurassic period and was a herbivore there are 17 bony plates on its back and a heavily spiked tail for protection the tail was a lethal weapon the four spikes could be swung under the unprotected belly of a predator with deadly force the largest plates on its back grew to 2 feet or 60 centimetres tall. Notice that the back legs are longer than the front ones which sprawled out to the sides. Those tail spikes could grow to 4 feet or 1.2 metres long. The front feet had 5 toes with hoof like tips and the rear feet had 3 short wide toes with hooves. It may have been able to rear up on its large hind legs to get to vegetation. Tyrannosaurus was one of the largest dinosaurs that ever lived. It was a fierce carnivore. Scientists believe that this powerful predator could eat up to 500 pounds or 230 kilograms of meat in one bite. T. rex had an infectious bite that was caused by the rotting meat caught in the serrations of its teeth. T. rex ate large dinosaurs like Triceratops. Prey bitten by a T. rex might not initially die, but as the prey became infected and weaker, T. rex would track them down. I rather like the colour of this mini Stegosaurus. It has really good detail. The skull was long and pointed and narrow, and of course it had a toothless beak and small cheek teeth. Its head was carried close to the ground, about three feet or one metre off the ground. Stegosaurus had armour-like plates on the skin of the neck, the hips, and possibly on the sides of some species. Diametrodon is an extinct genus of synapsid that lived during the early Permian period about 295 to 272 million years ago. Diametrodon is often mistaken for a dinosaur but it went extinct some 40 million years before the first appearance of dinosaurs. Diametrodon was probably one of the top predators in early Permian ecosystems feeding on fish and tetrapods including reptiles as well as amphibians. I love the detail on this, it's really good. And that lovely aqua eye. And look at the mouth detail. And the jaw opens and closes on this one. The most prominent feature of Dimetrodon is the large sail on its back, formed by elongated spines extending from the vertebrae.
two T-Rex battle it out in this next video. This is one of my first battles that I made. I think I've improved a little since this, but it's still fun to watch. This next video was made about 8 months after the two T-Rex battling. You can see I've improved some of my video and editing skills. Today my dinosaurs are going to battle. Give a thumbs up if you like dinosaurs. about new videos click on the bell icon next to the subscribe button on my channel and enable notifications today my dinosaurs are going to battle give a thumbs up if you like dinosaurs the nice thing about this video is that I rescued the two battling dinosaurs from a plastic bag in a charity shop.
Thank you for watching my video. Please stay right on here at Super Fun Reviews for more great videos. See you again soon. Please subscribe and share my videos on any of the social media sites that you like to visit. Thanks once again.